Hey everybody, uh, this video here, I'm going to talk about uh, my camera setup here and my different tripods. Um, this is what I like to use, it's a uh, Sony, uh, just give it to you right there, uh, ADR AX33 4K camera. And I have this uh, C-grip, uh, I got a battery light and a Tackstar microphone. And it's normally what I use for shooting videos. And then I've got the tripods here. And um, I'll link all this stuff uh, in the description if you want to click Amazon and check it out. You know, if you want to buy it, it helps out. Um, so anyway, so my two tripods, I've got a Zomi is one of them. And then I have an Andover is the other one. And then uh, multiple other ones, of course. But the difference in these two tripods um, is the plates. So with this plate, I'm just doing stationary filming. I actually prefer this tripod because it's got the uh, handle right here be able to uh, you know up and down and adjust and everything where this over here you got these little knobs you got to loosen and it's kind of wonky moving it around um, but you know it's got a different kind of plate though it's got what it's called a Swiss style plate it's got a, just a clamp and plate so you loosen it and uh, comes off and then you put it on and tighten it now what's nice about this tripod here with this kind of plate is this plate will go on the bottom of this so if I am walking around or filming something and then I want to actually make it stationary without taking this off the rig with that plate I can actually get it onto this tripod and then I can use you know the C grip to move it around so um, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get the plate mounted real quick here and just show you that alright now that I've got the uh, plate on the bottom I just got it screwed on there and to make it even between the uh, tracks here and normally we'll snug that up with a screwdriver and then it's going to actually uh, you know if I'm walking around filming or whatever and then I need to need it stationary for a minute um, it will actually drop in there and then I'm able to screw it on now it's not as stable of course as you know the other tripod but um, you know, you get you a little bit of movement. You can move it around or whatever if you need to. Point it down, adjust it. It's just still not as easy to manipulate this kind of tripod. But see, it will uh, it will stay. You know, like I said it's not the most stable thing in the world, but for uh, doing quick stuff, um, you know, it works. And then um, you know, if I need to uh, take it back off and go do something else. Then uh, of course you can pretty easily do that. You just loosen the knob and you can take it off. So um, that's why I like this style tripod if I'm doing any kind of walking around filming or anything. As I with um, this plate, uh, it will work, but when you when it clamps in with the uh, spring-loaded clamp here, uh, it's it feels like it's going to break. And um, I've got a couple different tripods, and they're they're all that way. You have to kind of jam it in there and uh, it just doesn't feel as stable as the other style here with the uh, actual clamp that screws in. So like I said, I'll link all this stuff uh, in the description here uh, if anybody's interested in checking it out. And uh, so um, yeah, I think that's all I've got for, uh, for now and uh, we'll talk to everybody later.